said my name. She said, no cat. Big Poppy Ralph here, you're feeling neighborhood douchebag, and today guys we're gonna jump back into the creepy red doors we left on off last time. And hopefully Madison doesn't try to tackle us through one of these sand doors again. So let's go ahead and jump in guys. Alright, so we woke up here with these creepy red doors all around us. Uh let's be on door number one. I think. Zilly, just a black void. I think I feel safer in here. Number four. Nope. Number five. This could be the last freaking door, I swear. Lex. Sorry, Madison, you're trying to change in there? <laughs> I'm not trying to creep in, dude. What the hell are these roaches come from? The root of all evil, the roaches. <laughs> oh, shit. Damn. They just FBI those freaking doors, dude. Whoa, 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 what the hell? They got that locked again. It's not going back in there. Screw that. Oh man, I'm gonna go back here now. Oh. Come on. Please stop. Oh shit! <laughs> he has a syrup peek there? Damn. Peekaboo. I see you. <laughs> oh no. Massive headaches. Yeah, me neither, dude. I don't get how your head starts turning and then you just start drawing shit on your notebook. He's like, chur, 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 chur. oh, nice. Now we got a creepy crawly roach coming up the ceiling now. Or the attic. Which, if I remember right, the attic is right ahead. Bring another letter. No oh, one's. Go, 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 go. Before she comes behind us, dude. More candles. This is huge. I've never been here before. Yeah, so she. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Don't worry about it. What is this? Picture of grandpa and grandma? Hmm. Age is just a number. You can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, when the time comes, you die anyways. Oh. That's a real gloomy way of looking at it. Such a happy picture of a memory. Anyways, let's get going. That was a year, man. Can't open that yet. The shape of this portrait is quite strange. Is this grandma? Giovanna Maxwell, 56 years old. You look like you belong here. Hey, what's up, creepy kid? Is this me? Five years old. Oh, it's Albert Maxwell. Is it Albert or Grandpa? Oh, what the? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why the shaking is, dude? Number 10? What the hell? Hey. Little. The love room key. Nice. Wait, so, does that mean? Oh, what the? Age. 
is. Beth, guys, God dig it. Just got out of school, man. I want to do math already. And behind creepy circle number two, we have 69. I mean, 13. And what those were here? 43. Hey, little roach. Alright. Mind the creepy creakiness of that? Well, I guess we gotta go find some more stuff, because there really ain't much here at all. We did get a key, so. Let's go to the little love room. Oh, the little heart key. Things so creepy. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police killed a police officer. The 43 by a police officer. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw. I get it, dude. They kept her when she was 43. You stop looking at me. Freaking Virgin Mary. I don't even know that's a Virgin Mary, dude. I don't even know what the hell that is. And so is that? Heart. Is that for you, lovebirds? Hey, it is! Nice! Get to go see what's inside the kinky room of Grandpa and Grandma. <laughs> uh, just kidding. Oh, what the... Dang, Grandpa. What's up with that box of tissues next to the bed? <laughs> <laughs> what a mess. The entrance key should be somewhere. Yeah. Of course it's gonna be that easy, Luca. Oh, look at Kitty again. Smile. Jesus. Oh, we got Lucky Kitty. There are meds everywhere. I quills. Quills or pens. Oh. Eye medicine? Why would he keep all this? Grandma died a long time ago. Hmm, so that's why Grandma's eyes are all white and stuff, because she had cataracts. I'm closing that door, fuck that. <laughs> Boop! Not letting any demon walk in here, dude. Hell no. Oh, what's this? Grandma's diary? Why the creepy thunder as soon as they say that? Elizabeth Maxwell. Nice, get a whole story. March 22nd, 1972. They say that having a diary is good for the brain. Well, we'll see how that goes for me then. March 29th. Today we went to a garage sale near the center. I found a book of very good recipes. Johnny came back happy with the book too. He was very excited about it. It was a good day indeed. April 1st. I woke up in the middle of the night. Again, I swear there was someone staring at me in the corner of the room. That's creepy. Uh, she has pretty writing. Uh, April 3rd, today I found my, all my jewelry scattered all around the room and my wedding ring inside the kitchen sink. I asked Johnny what he was looking for, but he swears he didn't touch a thing. April 5th, we had to bring Johnny to our bed once again. The book we bought him only causes him nightmares. We had to admit that it's a little scary though. That was the book about. April 9th, all my jewels out of place again. I cannot find my wedding ring. It was the cutest gift Albert ever gave me. But today, Johnny wasn't at home. Sometimes I feel as if there was someone else in the house watching every step I, I make. Yeah, like the guys behind me. Albert tells me not to worry. He might think I'm starting to go crazy. April 10th, what a relief. I found my ring in John's room. Honestly, I don't know what to think. Uh, okay. I didn't get any sleep last night. I could not get that stupid tail out of my eye, of the eyeless monster out of my head. I don't know why we bought him that shitty book. 
You bought your kid a eyeless monster book? I haven't written for a long time. These weeks, I've been from a doctor to another. Something is wrong with my eyes. They don't know what it is. What's happening to them? My sight is getting blurry each day, and it and it hurts a lot. May 22nd. God, doctor says that I've lost more than 40% of my sight in these last weeks. I find it hard to read, write, watch TV, even think of other things. My pupils are kind of erasing from my eyes. What the hell? So her eyes completely went white after that? May 23rd. I'm tired of medications. Nothing seems to help. I cannot stand the pain anymore. Why is this happening to me? It's extremely hard for me to move around the house with my eyes like this. May 28th, 1972. I cannot stand the pain anymore. God help me, please. June 2nd. I'm really scared. I know there's someone in the house, but nobody believes me. I know it's true. Even though I cannot see it, I feel the presence. There's someone living among us. Just get out the house, bro. Yeah, just sell the house, go somewhere else. June 3rd. I know there's someone in the house. I heard noises all night long. I swear I heard someone breathing while they're trying to or trying to get a glass of water. What the hell? This is Madison behind it like can I, can I get some? <laughs> what the hell? June 26th. I lost more, I lost more than 80% of my sight. Doctors say they no longer see any solution. I don't want to be alone in the house anymore. I'm not safe here. Uh, grammar your writing is notably getting worse and worse. You're writing more shittier by the second. Oh, God. <laughs> Look at those scribbles now. She can barely see probably by now. My brain's out of place again, but it doesn't matter. Nobody will be able to find it now. I just hit it underneath. Scribble, scrapple. Uh, thanks for the info, Grandma. Oh, it's in here. She was so sick. What is this? Elizabeth Maxwell, ocular death exam. Oh god, it's one of her exams. Uh, cataracts diagnosis. Strange type of cataracts. Both eyeballs are turning completely white. The patient loses her sight progressively in short periods of time. Ocular damage percentage, right eye 95%, left eye 87%. Damn, she was fully blind, dude. <laughs> we cannot define either sure what is happening to the patient's eyes. Please continue with medication as up to date while we find a proper treatment. Next visit, July 26, 1972. Well, Grandma, I sure hope you made it to that visit. Because your eyes are completely freaking white now. Jesus. What's in here? Oh, it's, oh what are these? Oh, it's those little slides. What are these things? These are like those little projector thingies. I used to do with them, but now it worked in a photo lab. They're actually pretty cool. Really retro. What's over here? Oh. Peekaboo? You in there? What the? Whoa, whoa, what the? That was actually the photo I had to take. I was just messing around. What the hell? Uh, so you can get to there somehow? I don't know how. What the, what type of mirror? Oh, nice! Hey, it's other worlds! It's a whole... What is this? Rhaenys Neptune. Huh. Those are the last planets. Let's see. You guys go there. And then I got Mars, right? Or something like that? Do I? Jupiter, Mars. Yeah, I do have Mars. So it's Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto. Wait, what? That's not Earth. The. Oh, okay. So it's backwards. What the? Oh, well, Pluto is no longer a planet, dude. So I'll explain that on the end there. But for this all of the time, I think Pluto was still a planet. There, boys. We're just missing Mercury and Venus. Can you stop playing with your crowns, please? Please don't let there be anything there. Oh. 
Did we get anything useful here? I don't even know, honestly. What the hell's that? That song. Where the hell's the statue, dude? Where did the statue go? That's creeping me out. Uh, excuse me? We'll open the door. It's open now. There's definitely someone here. So it was. Is that the stat? Hey! Did you Uh, I'm gonna go see the tape. Screw this. <laughs> Bye. You can stay there, creepy statue. Opening doors and shit. I'm out of here, dude. Uh, moving shit around. You're creeping me out. Well, I guess. Let's play tape number two. Becoming possessed by a wicked entity is signified by a loss of control over the body mind and the soul however that is often not enough for the entity it hungers for more things get much worse for the host in these cases possession is just the first step of the demon's plan it is said there are those that return to our world seeking to resolve unfinished matters from their mortal lives the victims of these wicked possessions are subjected to a departure of sorts. An astral transportation, for lack of a better word. An astral what? These malicious beings force their hosts to, to live moments that shouldn't be possible in a different place and time, perhaps even in a different dimension altogether. It's madness. It's unclear whether these transportations occur inside the mind or if the host is physically taken to some alternative reality. Alternative reality? I'm losing my mind. What kind of Doctor Strange multiverse things is this, dude? Hello? Oh god, you're still there. Hey, uh, Virgin Mary! Just trying to say hi. Okay. Where the hell is she go, dude? Chop, chop, chop. Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, uh... Not really that religious, but I think I'm even less religious now. <laughs> I'm not praying to that. <laughs> or whatever you are, lady with the plates. That piano is blocking the front door. Just climb on top, break through the windows, and capiche. That's it, dude. Bada beam, bada boom, dude. That's all you gotta do. You're outside the house, you dip, you're in an alternate reality, that and you're just back inside the house. Uh, am I going insane or that your grams clock the toilet with a bunch of cups? Why, right, man? Can you take a piss in please? Oh, oh, what? Oh, this is thank you for the for the little slides. Yeah, the statue's opening doors. I don't like that. Oh, nice. Is there anything here that I can see clearly? Oh, what is Grandpa this? Grandpa never got over her death. Damn. This little back school, 1968. So sad, he just had her picture there. Damn. Oh shit! <laughs> Why are you here, dude? I thought you were in the other room. Piss off. Grandma. You wanna watch the pictures of me, buddy? Let's 
Grandpa? It's Pops. Anybody? Little river. Or ocean. I don't know what that is. These photos are pretty old. Is that like his mom and the grandma? Uh. Creeping me out, dude. Let's go this. I don't know what the hell that is, dude. Is that a clock? What the hell is that? Oh, dude, that shadow was so creepy. Oh, thank God you're just a clock. Uh. Grandpa's office. Oh, nice. Bunch of saves. What got here? Thought the little safe opened. If you need the combination, you know where to find it. No, I don't. <laughs> What's this? Joseph Abraham Lake Store. I read rune cards, tarot cards, and connect to the past loved ones in the spirit world. Direction, clarification, guidance, and outcome via tarot and runes. Contact. Blah, 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 blah. Liar. Eh, this guy was a fluke. Fake. Oh, what is this? So you end up contacting them, I feel, because there's a bunch of tarot cards. How to contact the dead? All this time. Instructions for the silver locket. A photo of the dead person is required for accomplishing the contact. Light up some candles in the room. Turn off every light. 3. Use your own blood as a gift to the beyond. Your blood drop must be on the right side of the locket. 4. Close your eyes and say his or her name three times. Go with that. Repeat until your loved one answers. Call me if you need guidance. Call me if you need to get scammed. We contact the dead. Who's this? Pasquale Maxwell. Alright, Pasquale, you're coming with me. So I do not know them. Combination to the saves. Who the hell? Is that you? Is that you? God. Hello? Is that you? Are you still there? That's so creepy, bro. What the hell? Is it me or there's like a... Is there like a dot there? What is that? What the hell? What the hell? Oh, let me get goosebumps, dude. What was that? Excuse me? What the hell? Planets? What does that mean? Oh, sh <laughs> Hey, you're back. I was looking for you. Relax. What the hell? I don't need this. I know the order of planets already. I do need this though. Nice. We got Venus, and Mercury. Oh, she's spooky. <laughs> Where'd she go now? Uh, thanks, statue. Creepy ass. Did you guys see that on the freaking wall? Hello? 
Uh, Madison, you taking a dump? <laughs> hey, what's up, statue? Fuck this guy, get fuck this guy, okay? I don't know if I really want to run down this hallway, dude. Oh shit! Oh god. I'm never running again. Screw that. <sighs> what the hell? That statue just did a 360 no scope, dude. I was like, whoop. Boom! Takes me out with a sniper so Luca dies. Hey, where the hell did you go now, dude? Lucky kitty, please help me. Lucky kitty, please help me. Oh god, let's go, let's go, up, go, up, go, up, go, up, go, up, go, up. Oh, it's creeping me out, it's creeping me out, dude. God, she is right there. I was gonna say plane, like, oh, she could be right there. Oh, she's actually chilling there. You stay right there, man. Stop creeping me out. Doing 360s and shit. That was the freaking statue coming my way. Hey, thanks, Grandma. There you guys. I'm back with trusty old Mr. Hammer. Dude, just bonk Madison with this hammer, dude. this great grandmother 60 years 68 years old Philomena Maxwell what kind of names are these <laughs> they locked me up in here so oh. grandpa tried to contact grandma with this thing is that blood this is a locket, the picture on the left side, blood on the right side. Ew. Oh, Grandpa. What the hell is more shit outside, dude? Oh my god. That is so creepy, bro. Why? Why? I have a camera, I'm not afraid to use it. I gotta do this. She gonna creep out of me. Oh my god. Is that you? Are you back in your. What the hell? Hey, Madison! Oh god, oh god, oh god. How's it going? Why do you want me to get close to you? Oh, shit. Oh, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Fuck that. Go, 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 me alone. Huh? Oh, wait. What the hell? What are you doing up here now? Damn, statue. Be on my side, dude. You're supposed to be a good thing. 43. Okay, 43. So she got capped at 43. What? Uh, statue, where'd you go? Anyways, let's check this out again, shall we? Because 
we got 13, 25, 38, 10. So what I'm getting from this and that puzzle is that no matter how you add or subtract the ages, you die. So we have to get 43 because that's when Madison died. So start off with... Remember the kids? What, like five years old, right? Yeah, the kid's five. So, 38 plus five equals 48. I mean, 43. And then the lady's like, what, 56? Was she? This is... how old is she again? Yeah, she's 56. So that means... 56 minus... 13. Equal 43. Oh my god. Keep creeping up here, dude. I swear. Use this hammer on you. Stop it. Stop creepy crawling next to me. Okay, so now we just have the old man and the other guy. So, 38 and 10. What is this guy? 68? No. This guy is 33. So, 33. And then... We got you press of elimination. Oh god. What 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 the hell? Hey, it's not letting me it's not letting me get out. Oh my god. Luca, get the hell out of there, dude! <laughs> Why, man? <sighs> Could've just done that with a trusty old hammer, dude. Can we use the hammer here? Oh, we can't. Oh, my God. What's in here? What is that? Whip? Oh no! Why? Wow, lighters always bad, a bad omen, dude. Lighters are not that great. They run out of fuel. Oh god! The light's not that far. God. There are handprints on the walls. Uh, Madison? Where are you? The handprints stopped. Please, please. This is ten times worse, man. What do you gotta turn this stupid lighter on? God. Go on this way. Screw it. Said my name. You said no cat. <sighs> Piss off. <sighs> I just saw a creepy old wrinkly lady, dude. She was like, no oh, cat. God, please don't blow my lighter. Please. Why is this so long, dude? Oh god. I'm so tense right now, man. Go this way. Please, please, please. 
Please, please don't, please don't. She's right behind me! Get me out of here! Oh no! Don't film me now. Don't film me now later. Fuck. <clears throat> oh, God. Damn, we went the wrong way. Running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm... <sighs> running, I'm running, I'm running again. Please don't scare me. Please, please don't scare me. I'm kind. Did I go this way already? This freaking labyrinth's annoying, dude. I don't know where to go. Just looking down. Ooh. Ew. It's kind of gross, dude. I'm not just so saggy titties. <laughs> I was in that. I was in that bed. It's kind of gross, actually. <laughs> Madison! I wanna write some shit on the walls next time so I can make good directions, please. Where am I going, dude? Yes, I get it. You have huge knockers that are saggy. This is probably why you're trying to kill me. Saggy old. Goody! Right, so I'm just gonna follow her. What's the worst that could happen, right? Why? She went rope. Follow me this way. <laughs> I, I gotta get out. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm with you, Luca. Uh, just grab me, dude. She's actually kind of, kind of busty, dude. <laughs> uh, I don't think all these crosses are gonna help us, dude. Please, no more jump scares, please. Please, knock me out with those knockers. <laughs> oh, lady, dude. She's packing some, some breasts. <laughs> uh, what the hell is this? A graveyard? A graveyard? How, how did I get here? Jesus. Yo, hell's bells over here. Lysa. Michelle. So the people she killed or what? Jonathan Lee. That is straight into the bell, dude. these people, man. Just random people, or do these names actually matter to me? Oh, look, he has a, he has a sombrero with a, with a little skull. That's pretty cool. Heather. I don't know if she's gonna come for me or not. This place seems abandoned. You seem awkwardly chill for this, Luca. Where am I going? Where am I? Where are you taking me? St. Jupiter's Cathedral? What? Oh man! Why are we going 
going down some creepy thing again. God. Yeah, what are you doing, Luca? God. I mean, <laughs> this, this goes down really deep. It's really weird. Something comes at me, dude, I swear to God. Oh shit! <laughs> we fell again, you clumsy fuck! <laughs> Damn it, Luca! Dumbass! <laughs> God, God. How, how did I end up here? Dude, where the hell are we, man? Uh, we're inside the cathedral now? Oh, God. Alright, boys. Good enough for me for this part. <laughs> we're gonna finish this episode here with this graffiti abandoned cathedral we'll pick up here next time so uh let me know what you guys think so far in the comments guys i think this is a badass game so far by far the scariest shit i've ever played in my life so uh go ahead and drop a like guys and subscribe if you guys like the content and i look forward to seeing you guys in the next one later guys